what we got our kids for Christmas. But first, a little disclaimer. We are going to be talking about magical things. So this is more of an adult video, if you catch my drift. Yep. Every year for Christmas, we don't necessarily have a budget. Um, instead, what we do is we put a limit on the number of toys. Normally we've done 10 per child, but now that we have two children and one on the way and we live in a small space, we kind of realized that was a lot, you know? So instead we lowered it down to five presents per child. And that includes presents from mommy and daddy and presents from Santa. That's the whole shebang, only five per kid, okay? Right. So what we do is Santa brings all of the presents except for one, which is like the big gift, you know what I mean? Um, it doesn't necessarily mean like the largest gift, but the one that they're most excited about, the one that they want the most, the one that they've asked for, you know. Um, coincidentally enough, it is the biggest one, <laughs> but it doesn't have to be, you know what I mean? Um, and then that one is from mommy and daddy. Everything that we bought is from Amazon except for one item. So I'll leave all of the links in the description down below if you guys want to go like, get it for your kids, grandkids, friends, you know, nieces, nephews, whatever it may be. Um, because I feel like everything here was really, really affordable. Right. Um, I don't think anything was over like 30 bucks. Not like none of it. So yeah, it's definitely all pretty affordable stuff. And I'll let you guys know how much the things cost as we like show them. So enough talking, let's get started. I guess we could start youngest to oldest or do you want to do oldest to youngest? We can do youngest to oldest. Okay, so first up is little Theo. He is a year old. He just turned a year old on November 6th. First gift that he is getting from Santa is this little learning resources, grow it garden thingy, majiggy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I absolutely love the brand Learning Resources because not only are most of their toys like super educational and fun, which is always a bonus, but they're really good quality. I already opened it, so I'll open again and show you guys. We opened like all of these. I can't wait. I'm like a little kid too. I like cannot wait. <laughs> she really is. Like she saw this and had to open it. And I, I was just like, it's not even Christmas yet. <laughs> it's not even for you. I had to open it. So there's these little pots. There's actually three of them and they have a hole in the top and it comes with like little vegetables that you can plant. Oh my gosh, how stinking cute. And you can also and plant the flowers. Little flowers. And there's like a watering can and you can like water it, you know. This actually holds water, which is Does a little it? weird. <laughs> and it pours the water out of the spout oh and everything. My gosh. I didn't know that. That just upgraded this but toy. But it's all plastic, so you can dump water all over our house. Who cares? That would be so fun. <laughs> Look at that, guys. That's so cute. It's kind of like a shape sorter, but better. You know what I mean? So yeah. this is his first little present from Santa, and I am obsessed. And this toy was nineteen fifty nine plus tax. <laughs> <laughs> that tax that'll get you every time. Yeah. <laughs> And then also from Learning Resources, we have the Rise and Shine Diner. And look, it has all these different foods, breakfast foods, eggs, pancakes, waffles. Leon had a little oven with a pizza and he had this wooden toy set of food that he chewed on and that fell apart very easy. It was uh, Melissa and Doug. Yeah. And like all the paint chipped off of it. Right. So I wanted to get plasticky toys instead of like wooden toys. So we wouldn't have to worry about them eating any kind of paint chips or yeah. anything like that. Nice. And the texture of this is like a rubbery like latex. They just feel like really good quality. That's what I was saying. Learning resources stuff is generally like really good quality. Look at the milk. How stinking cute is that? I love it. I want to show you guys the little um, cereal bowl. Look at this. <laughs> How adorable. This but cool. it is cool, yeah. And it has like a little grill thing. You can like pretend to cook and stuff. But I picked this one out over any other of the play foods because it came with like bowls and plates. And yeah, it came with like um, a little spatula and a pan where you can like actually cook it and then serve it and then eat it. And it's just, 
it's so much more than just like fake food you know what I mean because normally you have to buy like the fake food and then the kitchen and the accessories and this was like everything all together and we got this off of Amazon for $21.99 so definitely affordable for everything that it comes with you know right. I thought it was a really good deal the next thing that Santa got Theo is this little piano. The pop pop piano. Pop pop piano. And yes, I opened it too, so I'll show you guys. When we bought it, it was $25.99, but the price has raised to $53. Oh. Um, hopefully that's just because they only have like one in stock. Yeah. And it'll like go back down because this is not worth $53, okay? Like no. How cute is that? I love it. <laughs> it's so cute. Um, it plays music too, but there's like a little tab that I haven't pulled yet and I don't think I'm going to because I don't like go off in the box and stuff. But you can switch between like silly sounds and then classical music. And I liked it because all the balls, like they pop up but they stay inside the toy. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like it's not super messy or anything. The, the only thing that I would say why it's not worth as much as they want for it though is because this wood's rough so we're gonna have to sand it down. Yeah like this corner right here is kind of like splintery but it's cute. I think Theo will really like it. John really likes it. I do like it. <laughs> and Santa also got Theo a Fisher Price game and learn gift it's like this little game boy it looked super awesome we saw one in target yeah and thought like it was super cool and we wanted to buy it right then but we also wanted to come home and see if we could get it cheaper because well theo was with us right too, so and it was the same price on amazon and yeah. free shipping mm -hmm. so we just got it from amazon that way it'll come in a box and he'll never see it until you know, Santa places and under the tree. Yeah, and it was um, eight ninety nine, so it was like super, super cheap. Right. Um, he has a little game controller and a TV remote toy, and he loves them. He's like completely obsessed with them. So I feel like he'll really like this too. I was also thinking about like maybe getting him like a little phone, but John obviously is a gamer, and he liked this better than the phone. Yeah. So. And Theo's last gift, which is his big gift from mommy and daddy is this barn. Every time I move it, it goes off. I'm not even touching it and it goes off. We made the mistake of pulling the tab on it, which is why I said I'm not gonna pull the tab on the piano. And it just like, I feel like it's gonna run out of batteries before it even gets it. This is, we're gonna be doing our farm jam dance. <laughs> but we got this, I'm gonna set it down so it like stops making noise. We got it from Sam's Club and it was, what was it, like 20? Four? Yeah, it was like 25 bucks. 20, 20 something. Yeah, and it closes up mm -hmm. and then the roof drops down. So it's like this little box when it closes up all the way that it has all the toys in it. Yeah, but like when it's yeah, all the it way out. Shows it there. Yeah, so it's pretty cool. Yeah. And it has like a little tractor and everything on the farm. <laughs> and it has the music so you can dance. Yeah. I definitely think he'll like it. It's very like imaginative play you know what i mean moving right along on to leon's toys leon is six years old and santa is bringing him this little string and beep from alex toys this is from amazon um look up how much it was on my phone if you don't care how and much it was 21.99 yeah i don't think we paid that i don't think we did either I think it was more like twelve dollars. Yeah, we got it. We got a lot of this stuff on Cyber Monday. Cyber Monday, yeah, for sure. So Leon's therapist, when he was younger, had one of these that was a farm version. But Leon loves cars, so obviously I got him the car version, <laughs> and he loved that thing like so, so, so much. So I'm really thinking that he's gonna like this again. He loves stuff that's like intricate, I guess, stuff that he can like fidget and like repetitive yeah. stuff you know He's and that's fidgeting. that's kind of what yeah. this is um and i think he'll really like it it'll help with his you know coordination fine motor skills all of that stuff and he loves cars so even if he doesn't want to string them like he can like play with the cars and you know win-win i guess <laughs> so santa also got leon some pixar hot wheels 
And they are twenty four ninety nine. Mm -hmm. And they are because they're Pixar, they have Wally -E and his little forklift and they have Solly and they have the eyeball one that Jody knows the name and I don't know. Mike the name. Wazowski <laughs> Oh my gosh. But um Incredibles, Finding Dory, it's just It's you know, more the Pixar of a gift movies. that Jody and Leon can share because <laughs> she loves Pixar. Uh -huh, yeah, I and love Leon Pixar. loves Hot car wheels. cars. Yeah, so um it's kinda cool though because they're like specialty it's like a specialty pack. They have a bunch of different ones. They have um like Disney and they have Toy Story and they have just a bunch of different ones. But I picked the Pixar one because I love Pixar, you know. Yeah. So and I, I think he'll love it. Obviously he loves Hot Wheels, so pretty much it about that. Yeah. <laughs> the next thing Santa is getting Leon is this little play silk. Leon absolutely loves to like run his fingers through blankets, t-shirts, like just he just loves it. He, he loves will cloth. sit yeah, cloth. He has um he has this little fidget blanket thing that he loves. Like he plays with it in his car seat and he will sit on the couch with a blanket for no joke like an hour and just like go through it and like look at every tiny piece of it like he loves it so we found this cute little silk I mean it's not little I wanted to get as big as possible because the bigger the better you know look at this thing oh it my gosh it feels really nice too it does and it has like a little astronaut and it has like little planets and stuff so I was kind of thinking oh here's another astronaut that he could like go through it and then like find stuff. He could like go through and be like, oh my gosh, an astronaut. You know what I mean? And I think that will like help keep his interest in it. Yeah. So I really think that he's gonna like this. It came with a book and it says you can like be a superhero and wear it as a cape. You can make a tent out of it. You can put it around your waist and be a mermaid. You know, there's like all kinds of fun ways to play with it. But I think that he'll just enjoy like looking at it. Yeah, like rubbing it on his yeah. fingers and stuff. So, and this was not very expensive. They do get expensive, okay? There's some that are like sixty plus dollars for a piece of silk, and I'm like, you guys are crazy. Right. But we did not pay that. We actually paid fifteen dollars for it. Fourteen ninety nine. Yeah. Santa got Leon this, and it is nine fifty nine. And it is too hard for me to open, so it must be childproof. Yeah. <laughs> it's called a hand kite, and it kind of goes along with, like, um, the silk. You know how he likes to just, like, um, touch right. things and go through things and feel things. I kind of felt like this one would be more of a manageable toy, you know? Like, he could, like, play with it in the car or, like, That's I don't what know. I was thinking. He could have something else he could play with in the car. Yeah. And I think he'll really, really like this. Yeah. This will keep him entertained. Because right for days. now he just has like his DVD player and his blanket. Yeah. And um, if he's in the car for like longer than like an hour, like he doesn't like it. Right. So hopefully some of this stuff that like he can play with like while he's in there will make him happier. <laughs> well, I really wanted to get him some more like sensory toys because he's been really like sensory seeking here lately. So I think that, you know, this will definitely be a favorite of his right he'll probably even like chew on it he likes to put things in his mouth and he carry does. it around i think it's because theo does it and he's like <laughs> copying him now but you know it it's happens cute. yeah <laughs> now the big gift which is the gift that mommy and daddy got him is this giant cardboard box and you might be like what's in that cardboard box another, another cardboard, cardboard box, box. <laughs> so funny enough this was the most expensive toy out of all of these, and it was just over $30 on Amazon. Yeah, $31. Yeah, the prices fluctuate for like different ones. This, I'll insert a picture right here so you guys know what it is. It's like this little cardboard playhouse that you set up and you can color and like play inside of and stuff. And they have different, like they have a castle, a gingerbread house. We just got him like the normal little playhouse. Um, but he literally, we had a box of wipes out today because we got some wipes and he was playing in the box. He couldn't even fit in it right. and he was playing in it. He so I was it. like, he is going to love his Christmas present. And 
he loves artwork so I'm sure he's gonna love to color all over it you know um they say that you can like take it down and put it back up but we'll probably just leave it up for like a couple weeks until it starts to fall apart and then just throw it away you know we paid $31 for a cardboard box that we're gonna throw away but um that's who we are that's that yep yeah. and that is all that we got our kids for Christmas from us and from Santa so now it's time to that's do the it. birthday show. That's all she wrote. <laughs> no, yeah. It's a birthday show. That's time. Okay, so let's say happy birthday to Stephanie and happy birthday to Michelle. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and share the video. Don't forget that. And we'll see you in our next video. See you tomorrow. Goodbye.